Kelly here from Western New York. My channel's name is Buffalo Art Room. I went to the Dollar Tree this past few days. Um, I like to go to uh, the Dollar Tree in West Seneca, Orchard Park, and as well as the Village of Hamburg. Um, so you're going to see different things from all of those different Dollar Trees. Oh, as well as there is a new one on Lake Avenue in Blaisdell that I like to go to too. That's a really nice one. So we're going to start off with um, some socks and things like that that I um, find. You are going to love these. These are the um, gold toe. Now, if you were to buy gold toe in the uh, Target or any place like that, you're going to pay anywhere from $12 to $15 for these. This is actually a two-pack, um, and they're very good. Gold toes are made to last, so this is definitely a really good deal. If you find these at the Dollar Tree, make sure you grab them because they're definitely something good to put away and um, you know, save them for, for gifts or save them for the winter time. Obviously right now we are starting to get into the better weather. So there's all different kinds. I bought this one, this one, and then I have this one and this one. So there's all different patterns. This one has like a little bit of a stripe on it as well. Um, and then I have some men's ones as well. So, you know, Everybody loves to see that banker in the Argyle. So I bought that one. And then, you know, this one has a design on it as well. Oh, and here is this one. This one was a good one. This is men's as well. This is a three pair. So there's three pairs in this one. Um, actually, there's three pairs in, two pairs in that. Yep. Oh, and I bought a three pair in this one as well. This is not gold toe. This one's Dexter, which is also a good brand. Um, so these are definitely, this is gold toe. Um, so these are definitely, and I got to take off my glasses to look. So right here, this says that it's $21. I don't know if it'll zoom in so you can see that, but $21, it's right over here. Um, but that's usually like, I mean, for $1.25, you can't beat it for three pairs of socks. Um, put them away if you don't have anybody to give them to now. I mean, donate them. You can do any of that kind of stuff. Um, there's so many different things that, that people are in need uh, especially right now. There's a lot of things that are going on in Buffalo. Um, I don't know if you saw the tragedy that happened at the Tops Friendly Markets. Uh, we, The city is uh, definitely, a lot of sad things are going on right now, and it's just um, heartbreaking to me. So anything that you can do to donate or help, that would be great. Okay, so another thing that I wanted to show you, oh, I'm sorry about that. That was Mordecai, he gets so excited because he's seen the cat. Um, there are t-shirts. If you go to the Dollar Tree, you're going to find Dollar Tree's um, t-shirts. So I bought a bunch of these. There's all different colors. I bought all different colors just because of the fact that I want to do, um, they have uh, this thing where you can take stencils and you can um, do, use some uh, bleach. You put the stencils on there and you put bleach on there and then it shows the design. So that's something that I wanted to do, hoping to maybe sell them for a little extra money um, at festivals or things like that. Um, also, Benny has a uh, cricket, so I'm hoping to maybe he can do some designs and things like that. So if we go to any festivals, art festivals, um, like I said, I own Buffalo Art Room. So I do different things and I sell different artwork um, like that. And a lot of my, my paint and things like that, I do buy. If I find them at the Dollar Tree, I buy them there because, you know, I, I try to be affordable. I don't like to spend a ton of money on my um, crafts just because of the fact that I want people to be able to afford it. And if you spend a lot of money on the acrylic paint or your or your canvases or your t-shirts and, and it takes you a long time to um, put them together, you got to charge for, for your time as well. You know, as an artist, you just have to do that. So it ends up making it a lot more expensive. So I try to make my costs lower. So that's why if I find things like this at the Dollar Tree, I try to grab them as fast as possible. And I like to put them away just in case. So that's why you're gonna see in my hauls, you're gonna see a lot of more crafty type of things because um, that's what catches my eye just because I try to to keep my, my prices affordable, okay? Um, so here's some more things that I do. 
And I'm trying to move a little bit fast because I don't want you guys to get bored because I have a lot of stuff uh, I've been holding on to for a while and um, I wanted to, you know, at least make a video that's worth watching. Okay, so another thing that I like to do, this is um, ribbon. You can buy any of these colors at the Dollar Tree as well. They have a wide variety in the craft section, so you can actually um, purchase these there and, um, you know, embellishments on all kinds of things. You can make wreaths, you can make um, headbands. I, I'm saying all these things because these are things that I'm going to be making. The wreaths, the headbands, um, maybe embellishments on the t-shirts. There's so many different things you can do with ribbon and they have all different designs here. Um, you know, I have browns, I have this color with, with the beads on it. This is nice. It kind of reminded me of a, like a snow cone or like cotton candy. So I don't know, it just reminded me of summer. This here, um, this color reminds me of like rustic and like the bear print. Uh, we have a cabin and so this is like the, the design that I want to do for out in the cabin. These are the colors that I try to stay with. Okay. I also found this one. Look at this. Isn't this the cutest thing? It has um, campers on it and then it says camping trip. Camping trip. Um, I'm going to show you all kinds of stuff, like I said, with crafts and things like that. So I hope I don't bore you. I hope you like it because this is definitely something that you're going to want to get into. Um, if you're into crafts, this is the way that you want to go. You want to do the most affordable thing that you can. So that's what I'm trying to show everybody. These are, I love the Dollar Tree paints. They're only $1.25. You end up getting, I mean, it has, this has um, four fluid ounces, it says. So anyways this is acrylic when you buy paint you're going to see it where it says tempera you're going to see it where it says poster paint what you want to do is you want to buy it where it says acrylic paint because acrylics are they're made with like a plastic so with a plastic if you paint something and it goes outside it's not going to come off um, because when it dries it dries permanently whereas if you use tempera those paints are water soluble so they will wear off or they will just kind of like um, dissipate where these will actually stay on, okay? But they come in those little jars as well as these little jars here. Um, they come in that, all different colors. You'll be surprised the amount of colors that you can find at the Dollar Tree. Another thing that I found was Mod Podge. Mod Podge is another thing that you can use what this is, you can get maybe a piece of wood or a rock, and then you can take um, Mod Podge. And then I found that if you use, this is actually just napkins. I liked the design, so I buy it. You can take a napkin and you can cut this off and you, you paint the Mod Podge on top of the, the uh, rock or whatever item you're gonna put this on. And then you place the napkin right on top and then you put the, this Mod Podge right on top. And it makes it like a, like a clear type of um, enamel on top of it. So it's actually a very cool thing to do. If you wanna try it, it's an affordable way to make something really pretty for yourself or for somebody. Another thing is um, they have all kinds of canvases. These are little canvases. I wanted to do something, um, you know, within my, uh, my, my kitchen or bathroom, maybe little sayings on this. This is what I was planning on doing with these, but these are, this comes in three um, and it is a four by six inch canvas. Another thing that I found, as I said, that Benny has a Cricut machine. This is the vinyl um, where you can, it's permanent vinyl, so you put this in the machine and it will cut out whatever shape or whatever if you have one of these machines, this is a very good deal. I have not used it, I'm not a Cricut machine person, I bought it for him for Christmas, so hopefully he'll teach me one of these days. Okay. But there's all different colors. Again, like I said before, I wanted to do a, um, a theme like this, like with the like bears or something, like a hunter type of lodge out. We have like a cabin out in the country. 
Um, so that's what I was planning on. I'm hoping that he can do something fun with this, uh, maybe a nice saying or maybe cut out a bear or something like that and we can put it on one of those little canvases. Um, that'll be a nice thing to do. Here's some more um, tissue paper that I found. Uh, just in case I want to Mod Podge something, you know, maybe for a friend or whatever that, um, you know, with the different dogs and things like that, you can put, you can actually put like writing on top of it and, um, you know, Mod Podge it down, maybe, maybe put like some kind of design on top of that as well. So that's something else that you can do with this. I have a lot of stuff here, so if you need to pause this and go get a drink, feel free to do that. Um it's still worth it because there's a lot of really cool stuff here that that you're gonna like okay i have to get up for one second here is a frame that i found and um in my bathroom i found these um i found the i'm sorry i'm, I'm seeing like a glare in my glasses in here and i don't want to bother people by seeing that um because i have one of those rings so that you can see me better my sister got it for me, so, you know. So I'm gonna turn to the side like this where I don't see it. Anyways, so I, in my bathroom, I have these sayings and it's pretty cool, it's really funny. It says, it says um, wash your hands and don't steal our toilet paper. And then it says, seriously. It's just so funny because, you know, with the whole pandemic thing, when everybody was going crazy with the toilet paper, I just thought it was kind of funny. So I found other sayings at a store that I saw, and I'm going to just do it myself. I'm going to print it out and put it in here, and then I'm going to paint this because it's, it was, it's white writing on black, and then this part was black, so I'm just going to take some paint and paint it, and then I'll be able to put this up. So this is my idea with this. You can't beat it for $1.25 as opposed to $15 for the sign that I saw in the store. Like I said, I'm on a budget. As is everybody else, I bet, right? Um, another thing over here that I wanted to show you that I had purchased, there are, you can actually buy cloth, all different kinds of cloth um, at the Dollar Tree. My dogs, um, they like to mark. I don't know if anybody has problems with their little dogs. They love to mark and pee wherever. So what I found is good is the belly bands. And with the belly bands, um, what you need is, it, I like to have different designs. They're just like a rectangle thing and then you put it around their belly and then they don't pee because they don't want to pee on themselves, obviously. Or if they do have an accident, it's right in there. And then obviously you take it off when they go outside. But anyways, these are different um, fabrics that I'm going to do when I do the different belly bands. I mean, I love sloths. I mean, look at how cute that is. That is freaking cute. And then little, um, little elephants. You got dogs. Um, there's all sorts of stuff. Um, here's another one. Oh, look at this llamas with cactuses, sharks. I don't care what anybody says, my dogs are my babies. So I treat them that way. I have a 16 and a 20 year old, two boys, and they, they don't wanna be babied anymore. So I need my dogs, you know? So that's, that's my thing. My dogs are my babies. And um, you know, they're always wanna be with their mama. Right, Morty? You always want to be with Mama. Okay. Um, I bought all of these flowers um, because I plan on doing different things with them. Um, they come in one sections at the Dollar Tree. Um, I plan on maybe making a headband or a headdress or something like that. Um, you can buy all sorts of headbands at the Dollar Tree too. So I found uh, headbands there as well and I'm gonna take a hot glue gun and I'm gonna glue these right on there, um, you know, to do something pretty, maybe for a festival, or maybe you wanna dress up an outfit that you have with a little bit of flowers. Everybody needs a little bit of flowers with their outfits, right? You wanna look a little bit prettier. Okay, so these are all the different flowers that I did get for that. Also, they sell these too there, and these are really nice, um, you know, it gives you that little feel. You can put them in a bathroom or you can put it on your table in your kitchen or even in your dining room, depending on what you want to do. Okay. Okay. 
All right, so, and then I also, oh, back to the cricket thing, I'm sorry. I swear I have ADHD, so I go all over the place. I seriously do have ADHD, um, so I apologize, and I, I kind of am like, my friends tease me, and they say that I'm like, squirrel, because I am. I see something shiny, and I walk away, and I grab something. So, anyways, these are for cricket, too. Remember how I showed you I had these, the different um, vinyl? This is to peel the vinyl up. See, there's a little hooky thing. These are at the Dollar Tree. There's your roller cutter. Oh, I apologize. That is my alarm. Sorry about that, telling me that I gotta go get Gabe pretty soon, so I gotta hurry up and show you the rest of this stuff. So these are all of the different things for the Cricut. This is one of those roller cutters. This is a spatula that you can smooth things or, or lift things up. And then a pick. I guess when you when you um, pick up the, the letters with the vellum, um, this is what you want to use. So I bought those for Benny. He's so spoiled. Um, another thing that I also bought is these are the, um, the chalk writer markers. So if you have a chalkboard and you don't want to just use regular chalk because it's not as bright, what you want to do is you want to get these. These are super bright. Um, you know, it just makes it look more vibrant. If you have a business, um, I do art shows. So when I do art shows and, and different places like that, on my big marker board, or not marker, I'm sorry, my chalkboard, I like to use the colors because that's what's going to pop. That's what's going to make the people come and see. Because, you know, if they're anything like me, if you see anything bright and shiny, or pretty you're gonna to gravitate towards that so that's what I like to do and these are the things that I buy for those um, those chalkboards with you know the for my um, my art business okay. what else do I have oh my goodness let me see I just want to make sure that I don't forget to show you everything because there's a lot of really cool stuff oh so like I said I like to um, be affordable I like to save money um, so I found this whole thing of laundry detergent is 64 ounces and um, it's $1.25. So I bought these and it works excellent. And if you like things really, really smelly, because it doesn't really have a smelly, smelly scent. I mean, it smells good, but it's not like, it's not like Gain or Tide. You know how they have the really good scent? It doesn't have that. So what I do, you're going to love this. I get the boosters. You can get these right at the Dollar Tree too. You throw them in with your laundry and it works awesome. So these are $1.25. This is $1.25. Like I said, this isn't really smelly. So when you put this in, it doesn't really make like the, the crazy scent, you know, of two different smells. And it really makes your, your clothes smell excellent. So they have this kind. This one is called Spring. And then this one is called Fresh Scent. So this one kind of reminds me of um, of linen. Yeah, you know how you can get the linen smell? Oh my God, it's so good. It smells so good. So you can get this. So you can have super smelly laundry for $2.50 because it's $1.25 here. The Dollar Trees are. So this is $1.25. This is $1.25. This is the size of that Tide that you're gonna pay almost nine bucks for here in New York for $1.25. It's worth trying it. If you don't like it, then you get rid of it. Use it for something else. Okay, we all need to save money. And I'll be honest with you, I bought 15. So that's gonna last me about six months. Okay, um, so once I liked it, I decided, you know, the heck with it, I'm gonna save money and I'm gonna get that and I'm gonna do that. Let me see, do I have anything else to show you? No, I think that's it. Well, I'm just so glad that um, you guys took the time to watch everything that um, I had to show you here. Um, and if you like what I'm doing, subscribe so you can see when I upload more videos. Um, I like to go to thrift stores too, so you might see things like that. And I'll tell you the inspiration I have for that. And then maybe you can get inspired for that as well. Um, and that's about it. So thank you. It was nice spending about 20 minutes with you, and I appreciate your time. Have a great day.